Hey guys, Rob Woodyard here again. I'm gonna make another video on this, how to install with Kodi, the basics. Uh, it'll get you every add-on that you need. Uh, but go to your system, uh, go to your settings, and you go to system. Go to developer options. Turn on all. Mine's already on, but turn it on. And then you go down to apps. You scroll down to top free apps. Open up ESO. You'll have to download it. Mine's already open, but you will have to download it. So I'm going to open mine. And now, uh, yours, once you get to this screen, I believe me, I'm going to slow down for you. But once you get to this screen, yours will look like this. That's it. Uh, you go to favorites. Let me make sure I deleted this out first. Okay, see I still got K. To, so I'm going to name it 18. Why not? Go to add. In your pathway, you're going to add this to it. I will have this link at the top of the page. Just follow it. All right type it in your pathway It don't matter if it's caps, lowercase, whatever, but just for OCD purposes, I'm going to do all lowercase. My eyes are and again, what I've done is I've actually went and copied this uh, off of the Cody site, and so I'm able to just send you directly to the link that you need. And like I said, we're going to name it K18. And next, and then I'm going to add. So after you click the add button, go down here, you click K18. It's bringing you straight to the link that you need. Alright guys, that's how simple I've made this for you. Downloading. You just go down to zip file, click it, download it. Let it go.
Okay, as you can tell, the first time I clicked it, it did not download. I clicked it again, and it downloaded. All right. So now we're gonna open file. It's. Uh, I didn't do anything different. The first time it said it was not successful. All I did was just click it, the zip again, and it installed like that. It just took me two times to do it. There you go. So then you go down to this and you just push the circle button. Click it. And voila. Go down here to the bottom. Install. You're installing Cody right now with all your stuff you needed. Uh, we will actually have to do one more link after this and you will have everything you need. All right, I'm not gonna go to the main home screen. I'm gonna just go to open and open it. And of course it says Cody is ready to launch, da 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 da. There's Cody. And Booyaka, all right. Now we're going to add the add-ons. There's nothing in this right now. Okay, look. You're going to go down here to the folder. The very bottom of the screen. You're going to click it. You're going to go to add source. And now you're going to put this next pathway in. Which will be at the top of the screen. We'll name it Fusion, or Fuse for short, why not? Okay. Now we've added it. But now we got to install it on, onto it. So, we're gonna go over here. install from zip file you're gonna have to click OK and it'll send you to it oh I'm sorry you can click settings and it's gonna send you to the settings and you're gonna turn on unknown sources you're gonna click it one time yes now what that did is is that you push your back button on your remote and you click install zip files you're gonna go to fuse that's the app we the add-on, the fusion, and everything we've added is right there. That's what we named it. Go to start here, and you're gonna install Hub Wizard. Okay, I'll do that one more time. We're here, you click your fuse, start here, and you're gonna Hub Wizard. 1.2.0 zip. That's the one you want. and it's installing see at the bottom config wizard add on enabled now we back out of here it's right there you click it and I'll show you again you go go down to the app config wizard I'm on it and you click it and then you're gonna scroll over to Android 
click that and you say yes and now it's downloading There you go. Now we're back to our main screen. You go to add-ons. All right. See the little box on the top of the screen here? You're going to click that box. Then you're going to go back up to my add-ons cuz this is the stuff that you just added on with me. And you're going to go to video add-ons. All right. Click that. And here's all the different add-ons that you can, this got stuff you can watch in it, stuff like that. It's just, but this one here, Exodus, is the one that's got the majority of the stuff in it that you'll want to watch. The, like new movies in theater, uh, playlists, they're endless. I mean, it's got cartoons, everything on it. So, after you click it to enable it, you can actually scroll over. I just updated it and it does it updates by itself but you scroll over and you can open it from here it's up and open now you can push left on your thumb your circle ring and it will open up like that back out show you where it's at right there that's what we just added to it is Exodus we can add another one go back to the box go to my add-ons to my video add-ons we'll add this one just so you can see that we're adding them and this time we're just gonna push our back button the arrow going back and voila it's on the screen so any add-ons you want to add to it, you got to go to video add-ons, which is in the add-on browser at the top. Okay, now we're going to go to the home menu. Alright, see how Cody's not at the top? What you're going to do is go to apps. Library. Click it. It brings up Cody, but this is what it did. It brought it up to the top, to recent. So now it's at the very top. You ain't got to go hunt it down or nothing. Hey, guys. Hope you enjoy Cody. Y'all have a good one.